the fuck going on with y'all man welcome back to another episode of boruto and before i get into it make sure y'all look at the links down below you can find my patreon where i am 10 episodes ahead with the full reactions available you can find my discord come on in and join you know what i'm saying also on the weekends uh saturdays and sundays at 12 p.m pst on this channel right here i like to live stream and play games very fun it's very chill it's very laid back so come on in during the weekend say hi in the chat you know what i'm saying um okay so last episode on boruto was they showed uh they little did a little bit of a flashback to naruto's inauguration as the seventh hokage uh which is kind of funny because he didn't even make it <laughs> to his own inauguration uh it, who, who was it that filled in konohamaru konohamaru uh had the transformation jutsu as freaking naruto which is very ironic because what has naruto been saying since episode one fucking I want to be the Hokage, the my ninja way, right? That's literally the only thing he's wanted to do for the rest of his life. Uh, that, that, that's his ultimate goal, okay? Um, and he gets it, but he doesn't even make it to his own inauguration, which is a weird decision to make, now that I think about it, if you're making the show, but it is what it is. Um, the way he didn't make it, though, I thought was kind of cool. That was Himawari. Himawari apparently has the freaking Byakugan. And she's younger than Boruto. And Boruto's like eight or nine right now, right? She's like freaking five or six. She has the freaking Byakugan. This has got to be the earliest case of the Byakugan ever, right? And she was able to gentle fist not only Naruto, but Kurama. So, <laughs> I mean, obviously, you know, it, it, it was um, a little, some anime stuff happened. Because Naruto's the strongest in the world, along with Sasuke. So, that was a little weird. But... Uh, I did like the fact, I mean, it was just so surprising. That's how Himawari activated her Byakugan. Um, because Boruto, <laughs> because Boruto freaking rip, ripped up her, her stuffed doll. You know, it, it definitely reminds me of, uh, of how in Dragon Ball Z, it took Goku, Vegeta, it took them so hard to get Super Saiyan. And then they fast forward to Super Saiyan Man. Uh, or uh, the great Saiyaman, right? When Gohan uh, becomes a teenager and meets Videl, and then freaking Goten has the super ha has Super Saiyan out of nowhere, right? Um, <laughs> it, it's like watered down, you know what I'm saying? Um, but in, in in like a funny and good way. So, um, and of course that makes me excited because I mean, shit, Himawari, she's got the Byakugan already. So she is definitely going to become a splendid ninja, is what they call it, right? Um, and then, of course, that makes me even wonder more on, okay, if she's got the Byakugan, what the fuck does Boruto have, right? My, I think it's a Tenseigon. I've been saying that this whole time, okay? Um, and it looks like it's, it's, he's getting more used to it. I mean, we saw in the Nui fight, when it activated, he could see Nui's weak point. So, now we know one of the powers of whatever eye he has. He can see the vulnerable spot or the weak point of someone's chakra network so that's obviously very fucking good he can probably spot like uh like a bruise or an injury internally that you have which is really fucking good obviously for fighting um so yeah that's pretty much where we are so i mean hey without further ado let's go ahead and jump into it let's see how these characters develop even more this is boruto episode 19 like and subscribe <clears throat> That is the Uchiha emblem. What's up, Serata? Her hair is similar to Sasuke's, actually, in a way. Boruto. What the fuck? Is he? Why is Boruto writing on his father's face? Goddamn. <laughs> Yeah, colored. My boy, Rocco Liu. Looking more like Guy in his older age. Um, okay, that was cool. Parents teaching the kids. Of course it's a Kage Bunshin, Naruto. What do you expect? It's your son! Sarada! 
ボルトのやつ見なかったかスネッチあっちですサンキュー That's weird. I thought Serato was going to snitch. I thought they didn't get along. There's definitely a friendship going on here. That's true as fuck. Okay, she's sharp. Shadow position. Also, I don't know if Shikamaru. Could do the, could always do this, but he, he's not weaving the the Kage Mane signs, the Shadow Possession signs. So maybe he could do it without weaving that shit anymore. That's pretty good. Hmm. They are alike, but they're also different in ways. Ah, I see. That's why they were showing the dads with their kids. They're always around. Sasuke, man, Sasuke, what you doing, bro? Hold on, before we move, before we watch the rest of the episode, before we, you know, this intro plays out, what is he doing? I, I thought he he's been atoned for his sins. What the fuck is he doing? He seems, it seems like he's still on his Lone Ranger shit and barely home. He's got a freaking daughter now, man. Come on, Sa I, I'm a big Sasuke fan. I have been since the beginning, even when he went rogue. Because I kind of agreed with him, Loki. Um, but what is he doing now? He's got a daughter, dude. He's got to be home. Come on, Sasuke. Damn. I felt I felt really bad for Sarada there. Oh,試験の話。受かったら足の体重が変わるって言うなら、オッケーじゃん。オッケーもいいけどね。みんなに何になりたがってるの? <laughs> No, nin ninja is one of the coolest words in the dictionary. But I think that comes from Sasuke never being around because he is a ninja. Papa to yeah. Damn. Sasuke, what you doing, bro? Come on now. It's it's, it's, that's just kind of pissing me off, Sasuke. What the fuck? He ain't spending no time with her. No way. What did she just say? She ain't never met him? Are you serious? What the fuck? Seriously, Sasuke? Well, whatever he's doing, dude, it can't be more important than fucking meeting your child. Hello? What? Okay, bro. My bad. I got, I got, I, I'm, I'm, I mean, I ain't gonna lie. I definitely felt some type of way when she said that. Because I'm a big ass Sasuke fan. You guys know. You guys watch my reactions, right? Like, all right. Whatever. <laughs> Looks like Sasuke belongs in the same category as, you know, Goku as some of the worst dads in anime history. <laughs> I do think it's kind of ironic how Serata needs to wear glasses when she's oh, the Sharingan. When she, you know, might probably is gonna unlock the Sharingan one day, which is supposed to see all. You know what I mean? <laughs> Serata, your papa's got the Rinnegan girl. 
苦痛によって脳内に吹き出す特殊なチャクラが視神経に影響を及ぼしシャリンガンへと変化するのであるおお I almost forgot about the Uchiha terms and conditions how to get stronger you gotta go through freaking trauma and emotional experiences oof so that's definitely coming in Sarada's future right wow I totally forgot about the Uchiha terms and conditions bro Wow, she's looking up research on her dad. Makes sense. Makes sense. I mean, Sasuke's history is not so great. He was a freaking rogue ninja, killing folks, doing damage to us. So, probably better off she doesn't find out about that stuff. Oh, fuck. That's disrespectful, Sarada. But I get her feelings. Low key, though, she's spitting the truth. Oh! Hulk. Hulk Sakura. Um, but I've been also wondering the same thing since OG Naruto. <laughs> what is their relationship? <laughs> True. That's definitely not true. I know Sasuke is doing some kind of fucking important mission. I know, but god damn, he could visit for a day making freaking little Sara to cry and shit, Sasuke. Come on, brother. Oh, 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 oh. Sakura. Good job. <laughs> Luckily, she's best friends with the uh, Hokage. So, uh... <laughs> and I'm sure some, some, some wood jutsu can fix that real quick. Hey, that's Shizune? Nice. I always liked her, Loki. She was a great number two to, to Tsunade. Why they got that young ass photo of Sasuke in the freaking Akatsuki uniform? <laughs> oh shit. That was when he was with um Suigetsu Jugo and Karen. Oh. Oh. Wait, what are they trying to wait? Um Hold on, 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 hold on. What are they trying to say here? Nah. No. There's no way that just happened, right? Or there's no way that would happen. Would have happened. That's definitely what they're alluding to here, though. Okay. If what they're trying to make... If what they're trying to do now is actually true... That's fucked. <laughs> that's messed up. Sasuke. And he hasn't... She hasn't met him? No way. Not even Sasuke is like that, though. Shit. Well, that's to protect her, though. Yeah, right. Because being in a Chiha in this lifetime, they're going to watch your eyes. So that's to protect her. We're supposed to keep her under wraps. Also, you know what? I just realized that's why Sasuke hasn't met her. He can't. If someone gets a whiff of his daughter, they're going after her. And I'm sure a lot of people want Sasuke right now. Isn't that the chick from the cloud that beat the shit out of Naruto? That's who Jochi got with? Okay, Jochi! Yeah! Okay, Jochi! <laughs> But yeah, back to the Sasuke thing. Um, it's more understandable now. And honestly, that may have been the best decision. To never have met her. Because if someone sees that... I mean, dude... That news is going to go around like crazy. But at the same time, they openly say her last name is Uchiha. So... 
What? You look like you, you, what do you mean? You have Choji's bill and your mom's hair. What are you talking about? <laughs> and your mom's eyes. Wasn't that just skinny skinny Choji? Yeah, he's got, that, that's, that's his butterfly form. <laughs> oh, she's probably going to learn that too. Ooh, looking forward to that. That should be cool. The boy. What did he just do? Wait, what? What was that? Was the Renegon always like that? I thought the Renegon, Renegon was just like... Always looked a certain way. He just turned it... It looked like he just turned it off. Okay. Interesting. Who this? Hmm. Yeah. So, at first, when we found out that, that, um, you know, Sasuke isn't around much for Sarada, then we found out he hasn't even met her. At first, I was pissed. I'm not gonna lie. Right? Because, why wouldn't I be? It's your freaking daughter, dude. Okay. But as the episode went on, you know, and with the with, with the things they were showing, and especially with that last scene there with Sasuke fighting some random, it makes sense. Um, Sasuke's past looks like it may still be haunting him. And whatever missions he's been going on, these Lone Ranger missions that apparently only he can accomplish is only increasing his amount of enemies and and in, in that in the episode we just watched Serata mentioned that there is no paper saying she can't find her own birth birth certificate which is something you should be able to find openly publicly right but she can't find hers and I, I would imagine her 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 birth was kept a secret or tried to keep it under wraps at least because if people find out she is Sasuke's daughter, that is another avenue they can use to take down Sasuke. That's just the harsh truth. But at the same time, they openly say her last name. And she's wearing the Uchiha crest. And if anyone that's alive in the Naruto knows that Sasuke should be the last Uchiha. So, um, but then again, she is in the safety of her own village. So she has not to worry about anything in there, right? Um, but someone, you know, someone could be following Sasuke, right? Someone could follow Sasuke. And if he meets up with her once and those eyes see her, him with her, then it could be over, right? And obviously we don't want anything to happen to, to Sarada. I want to see her get the Sharingan. I want to see her get the Rinnegan. I want to see her get the Mangeki. I want to see her become a badass, hopefully more than Sakura, right? Um, but yeah, so it makes sense. So I definitely don't, I was, I was pissed at, I mean, y'all saw it. I was pretty pissed there at Sasuke for not even freaking meeting her or rather you know so I mean the, the the most recent picture they have of Sasuke is him is him with freaking Taka or Hebi whatever they're Jugo Suigetsu and Karin right so oh that's another thing wait I mean look everything I just said is one possibility there is actually another possibility that could have happened that Sasuke got with Karin Sarada is wearing glasses, and they are the same color as Karin's hair. So, I mean, look, look. If Sasuke actually did that, man, they are just making him out to be a fucking another bad guy again. <laughs> uh, cause, cause obviously him and Sakura are married. 
and I mean, I, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be surprised if Sakura if she still married him, even though she found out that that doesn't surprise me because I mean, Sa 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 Sarada said it herself. I'm still confused about Sakura and Sasuke's relationship. It still doesn't make sense. Um, but anyway, we're off that. There's no way Sasuke did that though, right? There's no way that Sasuke actually got with Karin and that's Sarada's actual mother, right? Here's the thing though. There's a good possibility it might be. <laughs> um, I guess we're just gonna have to find out. That piece of information is very interesting. And look, I get it. Sasuke's trying to atone or tr has, has atoned already, I imagine. And I get he's good Sasuke now, but shit, man, it could have happened. We don't know. <laughs> cool. All right. Well, I did like how they showed um, an episode focused on Serata because she is, you know, I assume she is going to be one of the part of the main squad, right? She's going to be part of the triple. Because they like to keep um, you know, the, the Inoshika Cho combo. So I imagine, you know, uh, when they do create three man teams, it's going to be Borto, Serata, and some other person. Probably probably Mitsuki, if I were to guess, right? Um, so I do like how this episode was more focused on her. Um, but instead of her jutsu, which apparently she's pretty talented in, it was focused on her and Sasuke's relationship, which doesn't exist pretty much. So definitely feel for her, feel super bad for her. Um, but there is a reasoning behind that, and that reasoning is pretty big. It's so she and Sakura stays safe. <sighs> so that's pretty huge. So, but yeah, kind of a, you know, kind of a feels train episode there. Was not expecting that. Okay. Um, but hey, look, as far as so uh, I, I, I'm pretty much tw 20 episodes in, 19 episodes in, right? This shit seems fine. I don't, um, I have no complaints so far. You know, um, I'm enjoying these episodes. You know, there maybe have been one or two that were fairly slow and I, that, and I didn't really care for. But hey, at least they're not fucking flashbacks half of the episode of stuff that I've already seen. Everything that I'm watching right now is new. It's new canon stuff, right? So no matter how bad or, or no matter how the episode may be focused around potato chips, the Chocho episode... <laughs> Um, it's still new stuff. These are new characters that I'm learning, that I'm that, 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 that I'm beginning to be attached to, that I'm starting to see, you know, how their characters are now, and excited to see how their characters develop. Right? That shit excites me. So these are these early episodes that may be considered slow. I'm fine with this. Right? A lot of you, I think, I think a lot of you guys. I know I'm only I'm only 20 episodes in, but um, a lot of you guys were already saying how much I would hate this show because of my reaction to the last arc in Shippuden, which was not the greatest. I hated the flashbacks. I saw Rin say to Obito, I'll, I'll always be there watching 20 fucking times. I hated that. I hated it. <laughs> and they didn't play just that little snippet. They played the whole flashback scene, five, 10 minutes long, over and over and over and over again. Hated it. That's why I hated the the last arc I ship it in so much you know don't get me wrong I loved the Obito reveal Kakashi versus Obito Naruto versus Sasuke uh, Madara Tentails Jinchuriki you know I loved all of that and it made the flashbacks worth watching because all those all those great moments happened you know what I'm saying but the flashbacks were really fucking hard for me um so because of that, I think you guys took that, my reaction to those flashbacks, and thought that I would hate Borto because of my reaction to those flashbacks. But what, what, what I'm watching these first 20 episodes aren't flashbacks. These are new. This is new stuff. So I have no problem watching this. Okay. I, I like Slice of Life. I do. I, I, I'm probably going to watch more of those animes in the future. You know what I'm saying? I just want to get the, the hype shonen stuff out first. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, this shit's cool. It's fine. I'm enjoying myself. And if you guys are too, make sure to hit that like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Also, um, uh, check out the Patreon where I am 10 episodes ahead with the full reactions available. And my Discord. These links are down below, by the way. Come on and join. You know what I'm saying? And of course, on the weekends, Saturdays and Sundays at 12 p.m. PSC on this channel right here, I like to live stream and play games. Very fun. It's very chill. It's very laid back. So come on in during the weekend. Say hi in the chat. You know what I'm saying? Other than that. I am out of here. Y'all have a good one and I'll see y'all for the next episode. 
of Bruto. Aight, peace.